Welcome to 321 Photoshop, I'm Julianne Cost. Here are seven tips for creating basic selections in Photoshop. First, to constrain the rectangular or elliptical marquee tools to a square or a circle, just hold down the Shift key. To draw a selection from the center, hold down the Option key on Mac, Alt key on Windows. Second, when in the process of making a selection, keep the mouse pressed down and press the space bar, then drag to reposition the point of origin. With the mouse still down, let go of the space bar in order to continue drawing the selection. Third, we don't have to make the entire selection at one time. After creating the first portion of the selection, you can use the options in the options bar to add to, subtract from, or intersect the selections. Or we can use keyboard shortcuts. Here, I'll use the Shift key in order to add to my selection. We could also use the Option key if I wanted to subtract from the selection. Fourth, to reposition a selection, click and drag within the selection with the Selection tool. Or use the arrow keys in order to nudge a selection and add the Shift key to move it in larger increments. Fifth, use Command D or Control D on Windows at any time to deselect. If you accidentally deselect, use Select and then Reselect. Sixth, if you think you might want to use the selection again, we can save the selection. This saves the selection as a channel which can be saved with a TIFF or PSD file. To load the channel as a selection, either choose Select Load Selection or hold the Command key on Mac, Control key on Windows, and click on the thumbnail in the Channels panel. Seventh, to transform a selection, not the contents of the layer, choose Select Transform Selection. Control click on Mac or right click within the transformation, select the desired transformation, make the adjustment, and commit to it. Now that I have my selection, I'll add a Curves Adjustment layer, decrease the values within the alcove, and add a slight feather in order to soften the edge. 